over 45 of the island's top young golfers swung their way around Laguna Phuket's golf course on Easter Sunday at the second annual Laguna Phuket Junior Golf Tournament. Co-organized by the British International School Phuket, the competition came to a thrilling end as two competitors went back and forth in not one, but two playoffs to claim the overall male championship trophy. So, yeah, no, it was a brilliant uh, afternoon's golf. I mean, we saw lots of really good shots. Uh, certainly the last part of it was the most exciting when we had a tie. Uh, two great players both finished on two under par. So we, uh, we decided to have a playoff and get the crowd going. And then uh, the playoff kept going because they both kept hitting great shots. So I thought it was really exciting. Great for everybody to see that. Competitors as young as six years old took to the links like seasoned pros, alongside golfers as old as 18, all competing for trophies and titles in one of the island's only youth tournaments. Last year was, was a bit of a stab in the dark at, at junior golf for us. We just renovated the golf course after 18 months of, of nine hole uh, only. So just to try and create a little bit of um, promotion and exposure for the new course, we hosted a junior event. We had 67 kids last year. Um, this year we decided to do it in Easter, a little bit earlier to try and guarantee good weather. We don't want to risk uh, any rain or anything like that. So we managed to get almost 50 kids today playing. Um, which is a fantastic achievement. Um, all had a lot of fun. Working with the British schools great. They have such a tradition of uh, sporting excellence. You know, not in, in golf's quite a new sport for them, and we're very happy to assist them in, in growing golf and expanding their golf academy. The island has increasingly become a hotbed for youth golfers, and it shows. I think it's brilliant because we're seeing we're seeing a lot of really good players, and we're seeing a lot of really good young players that are going to be with us for years uh, and representing Phuket as a province and representing the schools, the golf academies. Uh, I think golf in Phuket is looking fairly healthy. Uh, I also think we're getting really good support now from a lot of golf clubs, which is, uh, which is helping a lot. So I think we should give them a lot of credit for that. With such a successful event two years running, Paul Wilson says the future is bright for youth golf in Phuket. And I know there's a lot of great golfers on, on the island in Phuket, uh, and now they've got golf clubs in, in schools and golf academies to, to support their development. I think the, the future is very bright for Phuket golf. Uh, we're looking to maybe do a two-day one next year, make it, you know, invite more provinces down, uh, different schools, different golf academies, so hopefully it will just keep growing. JP Mistanza reporting for Phuket News TV.